my channel. It's Summer Barnes here. If you're new, welcome. Thank you for tuning in. And if you're returning, thanks for coming back. And also welcome to another episode of the Beginner's Guide to Meal Prep. Now in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to prep stuffed bell peppers. They're very easy. It doesn't take long at all. And it can, be, it can definitely be used as a meal on the go or at home for lunch or dinner. And I feel like it's one meal all encompassed in one little bell pepper because you have your protein, you have your carbs, you have your veggies. So let's get into the, let's get into the video. The stuffed bell peppers, I will be using ground turkey, a green mix which has, dun, 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 what's in here? spinach chard and kale and then i will be using some quinoa and a red i'm sorry purple onion and some bell peppers so this is what i'm using let's get started so first step i am obviously cooking the ground turkey and these are the seasonings i'm using very simple some pink salt some black ground pepper and some taco seasoning um, since I use two packs of the ground turkey I probably will use like a pack and a half of the season taco seasoning but in terms of seasoning the meat you can season it however you like ground turkey is done and now I'm getting ready to cook this quinoa and you pretty much will cook it the same way you cook rice so the ground turkey is done. I sauteed a little bit of the mixed greens. I have my quinoa. And now I am ready to assemble everything. Oh, and I decided not to use the red onion. Don't feel like it. These are the two bell peppers that I'm using. I'm just making two and I'm actually not making them for me. I'm making them for my husband, Theo. So as you can tell, they are not standing up on their own so I'm gonna show you a trick the bottom part you kind of just peel off not peel but you cut off a little bit of the bottom to make it a little more flat and it'll stand up straight so as you can see focus it's standing up straight now well still kind of leaning but that's just because of the shape of the bell pepper but it's not toppling over which is good and you want to cut out the middle section and then I kind of just pull this excess out I pull this out and then I just rinse it out so I can get all of the seeds out you don't have to always cut or trim the bottom this one stands up just fine so it just depends on the shape of the bell pepper and then here you can see that I trimmed the opening lighting in my kitchen is horrible sorry you guys I trimmed the opening so you can fit a little more ingredients in there if you notice the difference between this one and this one and I actually that's what I trimmed out and I think I'm gonna do the same to this one as well there we go much better a wider opening Okay, now that I have a wider opening, I'm going to start stuffing the bell peppers. Now, you can layer the ingredients like I'm getting ready to, or you can have your mix like already mixed together and then just pour it in here. It's really just personal preference. So, so far I have a little bit of ground turkey and some of the green mix. I added a little bit of the quinoa and I will now just repeat the process. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I pretty much did a layer of like ground turkey, vegetables, quinoa, ground turkey, vegetables, quinoa. Okay, so I added a little bit of cheese and I used the Sargento sharp cheddar, like two thirds of a slice. Um, and now I'm going to put them in the oven. Well, the oven is preheating on 400 but I'll put them in the oven for a 
few minutes just to let the cheese melt now I will say that um, some recipes call for you to put the bell pepper in the oven empty and then take it out fill up your ingredients and I think put it back in um, I don't do that because I like mine a little more on the crunchier side but nevertheless this is pretty much how you put it together I will come back and show you guys the end result and I'll also leave some recipes down in the description box just to give you guys some ideas okay guys this is the final product so a little crispy just how I like it so that's pretty much it you guys like I said stuffed bell peppers are very very simple I'm going to leave some more recipes down in the description box just to give you guys some more ideas um, if there's something in the video or if there was something in the video that you don't necessarily like or you don't eat you can always swap it out so I used quinoa but if you want to use brown rice that's fine I used um, mixed greens but if you want to use spinach or dice up some um, broccoli small that's fine as well whatever floats your boat but thank you guys for tuning in and i will catch you guys soon bye